aware that the textile industry recorded an annual growth of 67 percent and as at 1991 employed above 25 percent workers in the manufacturing sector. Of that, that the textile industry was the highest employer of labor apart from the civil service. Concerned that the textile industry has witnessed massive decline in the last two decades with many textile companies such as Kaduna Textile, Kano Textile, Ava Textile, United Textile, first pioneers amongst others clothing shops and throwing their workers into the job market. Worried that the discovery of the oil in, the, in Nigeria has also greatly affected the textile industry in the Nigeria as a result of decline in the production of cutting, which was a major source of raw materials for the textile industry. Disturbed that government policies like increase in the taxation, higher cost of production, trade liberalization, resulting in massive importation of textile materials has negatively affected the production of local textile materials. These are simple issues. First and foremost, like the minority whip said, if we address the power sector issue, now, without power, you cannot, uh, you cannot make any meaningful profit in any manufacturing industry that you open. And so, first, it is for the government, which the government is doing very well, to address the power sector issue. Now, once you do that, most of these industries, especially within the textile uh, uh, industry, will now have easier access to power, and so they will be able to make profit because the cost of production would have reduced drastically. Attention, criminality will reduce in this country. So this motion, Mr. President, beyond us talking and passing it here, some concrete action must be taken to resuscitate the textile industry so that the aggregate economic activities in the three sectors of the economy I have mentioned here will be enhanced. I uh, thank our good friend for bringing this motion to say to the federal government, do the fundamentals, do power. The real problems have been indicated here. The first one, the fact that we are unable to produce the cotton that we need. To, uh, we, use, we need, of course, but far more important, far more important, is the fact of power. Power was the key problem that made most of the textile mills. Close. Really to push for the fixing of the power sector in this country. I agree that we, we should close the border, but I think that is only going to be a temporary relief for us. It's not going to be a permanent way of solving our problems. We, we have to really sit and uh, discuss between the executive and the legislature which ways can we find and fix these issues better and, and faster. Because time is of essence here. Even if we shut, uh, we stop the importation or smuggling in of uh, textile materials produced outside for five years, what happens after five years? If our, com if our com companies in the country cannot produce competitively, then there will still be a problem. We wouldn't have solved the problem. So we need really a very serious uh, discussion and conversation on the way forward about this. Uh -huh.